Little Mermaid Aria and Iceberg Magic. Once upon a time, in a land far, far away, there was a beautiful castle by the sea. The strong, handsome prince of this castle was Edward, and the dear princess was Mermaid Aria. On one windy day, Prince Edward, Aria, and their crew embarked on a cruise to explore new lands. During the voyage, as the crew was busy working, Prince Edward used his binoculars to scan the distant horizon. Mermaid Aria was controlling the speed of the wind in the air. Oh, I see a new land ahead. Oh, <laughs> yeah. yeah! Land ho! Land. Prince Edward immediately took the helm to steer the ship towards the land he saw far away. However, the ship was going so fast that everyone fell from one side to the other. Oh no! Oh, oh. And the cartographer lost his balance and dropped the map into the sea. No, not the map, not the map. Captain, Captain, I dropped the map, I'm sorry. Prince Edward saw the map disappear into the waves. No, we need that map. Arya, he dropped the map. Maybe we can navigate by following the clouds. Arya and Prince Edward looked up at the sky, but there were no clouds in the sky. Everyone on the ship began to think about how to navigate this wavy sea without a map. Meanwhile, the double-headed snake, living in the underwater world, found that important map dropped by the sailors. Ha! Uh, another piece of trash dropped by humans. Snake got the map and took it to Vega, the underwater world's witch. Your Majesties, while getting surround, I found this papers. If you don't need it, I'll give it to the scavengers, fishes. Vega the sea witch picked up the paper that Snake brought. She looked at it and realized that it was a royal discovery map. This is the map Prince Edward uses, Snake. What? A map? A map? Yes! <laughs> so, what are we going to do with this map, Your Majesties? You have two heads. At least use one of them, Snake. The evil witch Vega made a plan to track down the ship that Prince Edward and Mermaid Arya were on and make the ship sink. Meanwhile, Mermaid Arya decided she would swim down into the sea to try to find the lost map underwater. Her magical fishtail came back as she dove deep into the ocean water. It wasn't long until her friend Dolphy found her. Dolphy! We dropped our map during our discovery journey. Could you... Have you seen the map somewhere around here? Arya, if a paper map falls into the water, it gets wet and falls apart. You probably won't be able to find the pieces. Yes, but this is an ocean exploration map. It was made from a waterproof paper used by sailors. Hmm. So we can visit the scavenger fish and ask him. The little mermaid and the tiny dolphin swam quickly to the scavenger fish. The scavenger fish collected everything that people dropped into the sea. They didn't realize that Vega had already found the map and used a magical spell to create a dangerous iceberg in front of Prince Edward's ship.
As Prince Edward was steering the ship, he carefully watched the ocean waves and saw the iceberg just in time. Oh, what? What? He turned the rudder sharply in order to steer away from the iceberg. What was that? We, we almost hit a huge iceberg. Oh, my prince, if I haven't dropped the map, we wouldn't have come across this iceberg at all. Get on deck now and watch the waves ahead. Vega the Sea Witch continued to cast spells underwater and brought up another iceberg. <laughs> we will sink that ship, Snake! While Vega was trying to sink the prince's ship, Arya and Dolphy reached the scavenger fish. Hello, scavenger fish. Oh, little mermaid Arya. Hello, hello. Could you help me? We lost a map. I mean, we dropped it into the sea while we were on the ship, and... Hmm, what did your map look like? It was made of a special waterproof paper rolled up like a scroll. Mermaid Arya and Dolphy waited for the scavenger fish. I'm so, so sorry, Mermaid Arya. I have nothing like the thing you asked for. Arya and Dolphy left the scavenger fish sadly. Dolphy, I will swim back up to the ship and try to guide the crew. I will help you too. Vega the Sea Witch finally managed to stop the prince's ship with icebergs. As a strong wind was about to make the ship tip over, Mermaid Arya arrived. Vega! How did you find us? What are these icebergs? Dolphy noticed that Vega was holding a piece of paper. Arya, look! There's a paper in her hands. It must be the map. <laughs> Have you been looking for this? Give me that map back now, Vega. Vega lit a fire in her hand and was going to burn the map. But Mermaid Arya sent out a huge wave and extinguished the fire in Vega's palm. In the meantime, the dolphin Dolphy jumped into the water and grabbed the map with his mouth. Seeing this, Arya created another huge wave and threw it at Vega. So, Vega the Sea Witch was buried deep in the ocean. Arya took the map from Dolphy and climbed back onto the ship deck. The crew and Prince Edward greeted her with applause. Yay! Three cheers yeah. for Princess Arya! Hooray! I'm Hooray. proud of you and your courage, my Yay. princess. Oi, yeah. Princess Arya! She's got us. the map back! Hooray. Long live the princess! Hooray. 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 Yeah. 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 Then, all aboard! <laughs> These kind-hearted people, searching out new islands and beautiful lands that have not been explored in the oceans, could always find the right path, thanks to their intelligence and courage, even when their map wasn't in their hands. It was in their hearts. <laughs>